Hello guys, you are welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Petuga Majid. Uh, if you are new to this YouTube channel, kindly click the subscribe button and turn on the notification icon. I did some videos on WhatsApp and WhatsApp business and some people now ask me questions about what uh, ash, which now becomes Vipa. Okay, and I would want to walk you uh, through the basics of uh, this CRM solution so that you can know how the application works and you can also, you know, follow up with it. Uh, actually, for you to have this application, you just need to go to your Google Play Store uh, or App Store, then you just need to download it. Alternatively, you can also come to a web browser and you have access to this account. So, let me just, like, if you come to the web, you have to sign up or you can sign up from your phone and you can just come to this platform and just log in, okay? The, almost the same thing, okay? And of course, you want to know some of the things that uh, are available. This application can be used to create uh, an e-commerce store, uh, which would be easy for you to use. Let me put my video over there uh, so we can get started. So once you come to this web browser, I'm using the web browser, then I'm logging into the account uh by setting in the username and the password and if you don't have account you can just create accounts and voila it's so simple it's not difficult at all now once you get to your dashboard you want to see so many tools these are so many tools that i'm going to walk you through and you'll be able to see what you can do with what uh ash which is now vipa uh the first thing you want to look at is the dashboard, which will give you the insights to what your website is. Uh, here I've actually connected a domain, okay, then I'm going to probably show you how to do that. Uh, you can set up your CRM, uh, you can install this uh, Chrome extension, like I'm using Chrome to do my recording. You can create a sales funnel, you can set up your store, and your store location is available, and this is uh, very simple. Okay, don't forget the fact that if you are setting it fresh, like this is a new account, uh, you need to do some work before you get everything live. Okay, just like I just recently just changed the domain from the default domain that will have uh, dash uh, what's business or what have you. So I changed that to a new domain, a registered domain, which I'm going to walk you through. So now if you come to my bees. My bees will give you information about the businesses available, okay? Uh, your logo, your cover image, the name of your business, the information and everything, location. Uh, if you click on numbers, that will be, uh, you can add WhatsApp number, okay? You can select your code, your country code, you add WhatsApp and you can create that. So what happens is that you can use your number to set up your your con uh, your integration your automation your response and what have you i'm going to walk you through and of course when you get to social links we are still under my bees mind you when you get to social links you can actually connect your instagram your any other you can add more and you can select any of the you can select twitter linkedin tiktok you can select in fact you can drive traffic from any uh, platform to this uh, plat uh, to this store and that is how it works. And uh, when you come to links, uh, this is if you have uh, set up your Google My Business or you set up any other links. Okay, if you set up any other links, and that will work here. You can add more links. You can just, you know, set up. You can just create more links and people can then Click on those links in order to get to your store. Now your domain, this is where we actually change the domain. You can use a customized domain free that will end with .watts.bz, which is .watts.business. Uh, but in my own case, and what I have actually done, I actually connected a domain. So there's a registered domain, you know, like uh, registered, and I connected it changing the uh, a domain name server records. That is a record. And that is a domain that is active now and it's online. And you can here under pages, you can create multiple pages. 
you can set up your funnel you can set up some other uh, facilities with it and then you can then view your business page that will take you to your website uh, using this uh, VIPA as your storage facility and using your domain so what you are just doing is you have a domain you have a storage facility that already have the integration the tools then you can have a website a complete website uh, that you can start running live now so the next one is the CRM we are we are true with this we, are, we want to go to CRM of course when you talk about CRM you want to look at your co your customer relationship uh, management solution so here you want to co consider your contacts you want to see your tickets ticket is if somebody has issues or complaints or what have you you are going to see all the tickets here and uh, you can address them you can see all your contact you can see all the whatsapp group if you have connected your whatsapp to this and uh, you can see all your broadcast you can create your broadcast and you can do your messaging your charts your quick replies your funnel your tags your ticket status those who have uh, open an order that has not been closed a pending order and all those you are going to see all those here okay now the next one is your store okay when you get to your store you will see every information that you need for your e-commerce store every information you want to see your dashboard this is the overview of all the orders that you have within this period to this period and you can check you can change that date in order to look at how you are growing within a week or within a month or within a year it depends as you preferred so you want to see your total orders you want to see your net revenue that means that you must have set up your payment your uh currencies and everything you are going to see all the details here the status unpaid paid refund and all those you are going to see and you are going to check your revenue as you are growing in sales and this is a very powerful insight so that you will know whether you are profitable or you are not then when you look at your orders here you are going to see all the orders that you have uh whether uh, the pending orders the delivery and what have you you are going to you can export them meaning that you can download that content and you can then work with a team in order to fulfill all the others now the, your products here you can add more products you can add products can put price you can do a lot of things uh you can just click on add new you can take simple products you can take variable products now a simple product is just one product okay variable product has probably varieties sizes colors uh, and what have you so you can have that you just need to click on one and you give the details you can see you can give all the details and once it is done it goes live that is how it, then you can also set categories so that your product can have different categories and this will help people to search if people are searching for content on a given category they will be able to search for all the products within that category you want to put your products in categories so that it will be easy for your customers to navigate and you know get the best uh, within a very short time because people will not want to be going through on this uh, unneeded products just because they are looking for one then we look at badge uh, badges uh, which is also important you can put some products you can give them badges you can put uh, some attributes here okay products you can create an attribute you just need to talk about some of these custom attributes you want to talk about sizes you want to talk about colors you want to talk about weight and you want to set those attributes so when you are now creating a variable product you can just select those attributes that you have already created and that is how that works now you want to talk about your shipping uh meaning that probably if you are going to add shipping fees within your location if they are going mainland or island or wherever your location is you want to now look at the cost of shipping such products to uh their location and uh, you want to do that you can first of all activate it and you now set the shipping records if it's a flat rate if it's by percentage and what have you and you can do all those otherwise you can just save it as uh, inactive and check out check out you want to look at your form what information do you want to have on your checkout your form 
you can check what you really want your audience to input whether you want them to put their address you want them to put their city their code anything you want them to put you can add that and you can also set up the settings for your checkout so that it's going to look and of course you can also do uh whatsapp official uh, verification so people can actually check out via whatsapp message and that is also uh, important or you can do user mobile phone number which means that a uh, uh, one time password will be generated to that user and that val validates uh, the recipient's contact and what have you you want to really look at all these tools in order to know how you want to work your way through then payments there are payment integrations okay different payment integrations uh we have pay later okay which you can be enabled you have pay stack pay stack if you are in nigeria for instance you want to make use of pay stack is very very important uh, you can just go to your pay stack account i've done some videos on that if you check my youtube question on paystack stuff front yes i've also done some videos on that probably i'm going to put the link paystack how to receive yes uh, the link in the description so you want to set up your paystack uh, uh account so that once this is enabled people can definitely you know connect make their payments uh, get on the paystack and all you do with your phone is to receive the order and deliver that is just how it works and of course we are not a stripe is coming up in Nigeria, but pay later means that uh, this pay later means that the customer will pay after the order has been received. There will be a follow up call or caution, and that's how pay later works. So it means you pay on delivery or you pay, uh, we will later send you the details, but your order will go smoothly and what have you. But I will recommend that you make use of Paystack because the payment solution is here in Nigeria and uh, they are reliable. I can vouch for that. Uh, this is not an affiliate uh, tutorial, but I know Paystack and I've been using it for clients. Uh, there are other alternatives also you can do. Uh, then these payment modes will always be updated. Uh, Vipa will always update this. So something you can just you know now the settings general setting the name the currency uh, you can change your currency if you if you are targeting another location okay you want to change your currency to target that location and you want to do a lot of things then you can visit your store here now let us go to pools pools uh, here you want to just know what people are saying probably you want to create a pool and you want to give uh questions options that people can just you can even make it pu uh, public and people can just you know for you to know what people want you can just set up questions and do that now integration now this is how and where uh your marketing becomes very profitable for you whereby you can actually integrate uh any of these tools okay you can integrate any of these tools if you want me to teach or to show how to do some of this i can definitely do that put in the comments but just for today uh you can just go to your business manager if you have a business manager account and you create uh for facebook you can create a business manager account click on facebook uh, pixel okay and you just enter a pixel id here okay it's simple and of course you can also go to that uh, pix, uh facebook and click on uh google analytics and you enter the de details there okay that is the tracking id you can just enter these two information just the id and it's going to really work and uh, one of the things you are going to see if you have actually done that uh, is that uh, there is this tracker here facebook pixel helper that i am using to know the website that is actually tracking their audience and knowing what is happening on their website and website that is just losing those information so you can see that this vipa definitely has a facebook tracker and you can see that everything that is done on this platform is being monitored so you too want to make sure that you monitor whatever is done on your uh, account then you then have your account where you can now see your information and what have you and you can definitely 
wipe your data here, meaning that you delete everything that you have in your record, or you even delete the account completely. Then you can look at the subscription. Now, this is where VPAR becomes very profitable. You can see that we have a free subscription per month. You are not going to make any payment. Uh, you just have 20 megabytes of at this space, which means that when you are uploading content onto uh, your products, your products may not be too much because 20 megabytes is just so small. So, but then you want to make sure that your pictures, your product pictures are in kilobytes, okay? Because if they are in megabytes, that means that you only have probably 20 pictures to be uploaded. But when you have in kilobytes, then you can upload more content. So this is the number of uh, space you have for free and uh, you have some solutions available here. Whereas they have the payments and even they have agencies that you have unlimited and one gig for storage. And there are so many other you know, unlimited solutions that are available. But I can tell you that you can start this for a free plan and you can start with that and it is a good start. The, subsequently, as you are progressing in your sales, in your marketing, you want to then, you know, improve your storage, improve your solutions, and even the quick replies per days and all those things, you really want to improve all those. So having said all this, this is a summary of Vipa, and if you are interested in using this tool, it is just as simple as you, you come to your account, vipa.com, you can see, and uh, you click on login, uh, once you click on login, uh, you you can if you, if you have logged in via your mobile phone, you can do that. If you have not, you just need to create account, and it's as simple as that. So you only need your name, your email, and your password, and you verify, you, and that is just all. So subsequently, if you are interested in any of these uh, aspects, kindly put in the comment. I'm going to do videos specifically to explain how those uh, aspects work so that uh, you will be having so much benefit uh, in using this platform. Okay, I wish all the best. And if you are new to this YouTube channel, kindly click on subscribe button, share my content. It's free and help somebody to start a business online. Thank you and God bless.